Hello, Brenton with Odd Acting here. In this video, I have a mail call. So you saw the thumbnail of the video. You know what is in this. I actually know what's in this as well. But this mail call is from my brother because my brother has been having really good luck at finding vehicles. So since you know what's in here, let's go ahead and uh, take a look. We've got the off-road series. So this is a five car series. I do not think there was a chase series with it. We've got the Toyota Land Cruiser. We've got the, oh yeah, I think he sent me a Lucid Air too, which was awesome because I hadn't found that yet. That was as an H case car. Lucid Air, we've got the Mercedes Unimog. We've got a, let's see what else is in here. Oh man, he sent me the cool Suzuki Sambar, yes. And the Ford Interceptor, spectacular, spectacular. We've got the Jeepster and we have two more in here. I don't think there's any, yeah, that's it. All right, and we've got the old 442 and the Land Rover Defender Double Cab. This off-road set is amazing. That's what we're going to open up in this video. Obviously, you saw the thumbnail, but again, he sent me a Lucid Air as well as the two Matchbox cars that I did not have yet. Obviously, I have them now, but uh, I'm glad to have extras, especially the Lucid Air, because I didn't actually pick up a second one, and I regretted that. Now I have one that's epic. So here we go, we've got the five car set, Mercedes, Benz, Unimog, and on the back you can see all five you are trying to hunt down, which is sweet. So, my brother found all five, let's do it. One through five up top, Mercedes, Benz, Unimog. And these were expensive, I think these, he said, were on the $2 range. So, I owe him for this set, I will owe him for a bunch of other cars too, so he's just keeping a tally for me and I will send him the finances soon once I uh, want basically whenever he stops finding cars because he keeps finding fantastic cars up in Maine where he lives so this is great Tampa work again probably worthy of the two dollars price point that it has overall spectacular vehicle I'm glad to add this one to the collection I, I'm glad to have all of these uh Jeep Commando 67 Jeep Commando with Eagle Motors on it or I'm sorry Earl Motors on it Earl We've seen that Tampa work done before. Nice to have that. Brown tires again, but I think all of them do. Not really that bad. Not a bad thing. Again, the windshields. What is up with the windshields? Wow. They really put the Tampa work on that. Look at those bright lights. It's like, hello. Hello. I'm a bug. Oh, that's not a bug. It's a Jeep. I get it. It just looks like it has big eyes staring, staring at you. It's like Martin the Gecko. We had a moment. <laughs> I don't know if you guys have seen that commercial, but that's definitely what it reminds me of. All right, next up, the old 442 W30. You know what this reminds me of? Matchbox had a um, mudding off-road Mustang. Now we've got the mudding off-road 442. I think this used to be kind of like in the blings or donks kind of group or high rollers or something like that. Uh, this also reminds me of a Harlequin because <laughs> it's got all the mismatched colored panels. Look at that paintwork, though. Like, is this tampoed? That's a lot of tampo work if it is. Like, that's a bunch of passes and different colors in different places. This is this is easily my favorite out of the bunch. Oddly enough, this is spectacular. Huh? Who'd have thought? This thing is really cool. All right, we've got the Jeepster. Or I'm sorry, Jeepster was there. We've got the Toyota Land Cruiser in green. I regret not picking up all of the off-road Matchbox set. That was a really good set. It had the Land Cruiser in it. It had the Raptor in it. It had a couple other things in it. I only ever picked up the Raptor. I never picked up the Land Cruiser, and I'm regretting that. That was a number of years ago. But check this out. Spectacular Tampa work. Again, this whole set is dynamite absolutely spectacular off-colored roof which is great and last up is the defender double cab 2015 rover land rover defender double cab and obviously i'm huge softy for land rovers so it's really nice to have one of these to add to the collection good tampa work right on the hood good stuff they tampoed even the plastic up front here with the headlights. They didn't do the headlights headlights. They just did the 
auxiliary lights. That's interesting. But they did put the Defender on it and the Land Rover, which is kind of iconic. I mean, you almost have to do that. The other side is really well done too. Definitely like this one and this one. I think these two, the, the Oldsmobile and the Defender are my favorite. I think just because I like Defenders. I think the Unimog and then the Toyota and then the Jeep. But this is a great five car set. Let me know which ones are your favorites in the comments below. Let me know if you have found this set. And until the next one, have a good one.